Hmm, what am I looking for? Look at this broke lamp. This broken lamp. Did you do this? Did you break this over your son? Fucking hell. Damn thing must have fell off the table. Uh-huh. The lamp just fell off the table. All the boy was faffing about, playing salts and salt fish. Who knows with the lad? Why are you lying to me, Toad? Is it still plugged in? This could be dangerous. All right, Toad, you're gonna talk. Need to get a dustpan one of these days. I know something's off here, Toad, and I know you know I can't leave until I find out why. So can we please just skip to the end of the page before I have to get mean? Yeah, you don't want well, me to release the big bad want, wolf. Baby. There's nothing going on. Don't you lie to me, Toad. That's it. There's just there's just nothing to tell. Look around the room and see for yourself. Everything has its explanation, you'll see. Honestly, Toad, I don't know if I will. And I don't know if I've got the patience to reverse engineer whatever scheme this is. Me boys in the other room, Big B. Come on now. We're friends, right? I'm gonna I beat mean, you, Toad. I called you here. Can't we just start over? Down! <laughs> <laughs> right now. What the fuck happened before we showed up? Big B, I it even has the Alright, I feel kinda bad for beating you, Toad. <laughs> I'm sorry. TJ is afraid of the big bad wolf. Yeah, well, who isn't afraid of the big bad wolf? It was an accident. I lost my temper. Okay. Maybe, maybe it's it got away from me a bit. I'm sorry. Okay. Oh my god. I didn't do that. I didn't hit him that hard. Your hat. Yeah, I didn't do that. You can't Maybe accuse me of that. You didn't. He didn't. <sighs> it was that butcher, a, a Tweedle, Dumb or D. You gotta strip them down to their Johnnies before you can tell which is which. They come bulging in, screaming about something a woodsman had. Or thought he had, I don't know. He tore up the place, beat me up when I said I didn't have it. I tried to go out the window, but he pulled me back in. <sighs> it's been a hard morning, I can tell you that. What did you tell him? If you're worried about your own skin, forget it. I didn't tell him nothing about you or your shit. I would have told you. I wanted to, really, I did. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, well, Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. I even tried to give a bastard a coat. He wouldn't take it. I feel bad He's for coming. beating Toad now. The girl. I legitimately feel bad. <laughs> from people who Poor live Toad. Here. Uh, sometimes. Borrows. I don't steal nothing. Turn around here would astonish you, mate. We'll merely repossess what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking the coat now. If she has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Fetch him the fur. Get the fur coat, son. Fine bit of dress it is. I'm sorry for hitting you, Toad. I just lost my temper a little bit. Hey, that's from the fairy tale. No, I wouldn't wear it outside. Yeah, it's kind of creepy. It's donkey skin. Wait. There's a letter. Oh my god. It's an envelope. Fucking hell, of course there is. My luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince <laughs> Do you want to try and give it to him, or...? Um... Should we open it? Don't make it a dilemma. Mm, uh, uh, let's open it. Screw it. I'm nosy. Why not? I'm sorry. Fate. What could she have been sorry for? I don't know. For being a hooker? But maybe Lawrence does. Well, it's been quite a surprising day for all of us, hasn't it? I see you out, but I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. I'm sorry, Toad. You don't have to be mad at me. It was an accident. It was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Uh, see ya. Bye, TJ. I'm sorry I scared you by beating your dad up. Man, I am a freaking chronic smoker. I'm sorry, Snow. I didn't mean to beat him. I'll be honest, Big Beat. I don't really know how to feel about what happened in there. We got what we came for. 
Some information. It'll be all right. Don't be mad at me. Come on. I'm sorry. So the princes now? Lawrence's. Yeah. It's our best lead. Our only lead, really. When you put it that way. All right, to Lawrence's. Prince Lawrence, he's probably dead anyway. Either dead or drunk. Guess we're about to find out. South Bronx, early morning. At Lawrence's apartment. I don't stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? Okay, I won't beat yes, anyone up this you. time. It's not that simple. It's we're okay. here to question Lawrence. Bump him up on the suspect list, or cross him off entirely. Okay. What is it? I just. I just don't think he did it. In cases like these, Snow doesn't entirely possible. agree. For Mondays, maybe, but this is different. Okay, fine, whatever. Gee, Snow, you're a pain in the ass. You are a pain in the ass. Let's open this freaking door. Knock, knock, motherfucker. Um. Can you hear me? It's open. Wow, that's weird. Are you okay? I don't think I'm gonna get a response. Let's try one more time. Third time's a charm. Hey, answer me. And nothing. Okay, let's go in. And he's probably dead, just like I thought. Ooh, it stanks in here, don't it? Stanky. Ooh. Look on your face does not seem too pleased. Oh, what do you know? He's dead. Pretty sure he cut his own wrist, didn't he? Did he? This is a suicide. Or was it just made to look like a suicide? Oh no, he definitely got stabbed. Oh my God. Snow, get help. Stay with me, man. You're gonna be okay. Hey, is he alive? Be okay. just, no, oh, no. he is alive. Let me go. What, you wanna die? So... She... What is it that you're telling us? He wants water. Bigby, water. Kitchen. Now. Go. Oh god, where's the kitchen? Uh, if I was the kitchen, where would I be? Oh god. The pressure. I can't handle it. He's gonna die. He's still gonna die. I don't know where the fuck the kitchen is. Alright. Kitchen's not this way. Okay, kitchen is this way, apparently. Thank you, camera, for moving on me. And screwing me up. What the? Okay, the freaking controls are like all... There we go. There's some water. Let's go ahead and give this to old Lawrence here. Here's your wah wah, buddy. Is that better? Can you talk now? If you have something to ask him, you should do it now. Uh, who did this? What happened? What happened? Faith. Faith happened? She came and beat you up and stabbed you, then got her head chopped off. Faith is dead, dude. And so are you. Oh, he's crying. Well, nighty night, Lawrence. It was nice meeting you. I don't think we'll be seeing each other soon. How tragic. Do you still have that letter? Yeah, of course. It's pretty useless now, don't you think? It's only two words, but he died without seeing them. Well, I don't think showing him the letter was an option. Whatever. We need to figure out what happened here and find whoever did this. Yes, yes, we do. That's what we're here for. All right, let's look around this apartment. What happened? Oh man, he's got some, got some unread mail right there. Are these all letters from Faith? Let's go over there and oh, let's check out the knife. I guess it's a nice knife and all, pretty fancy. The mirror showed me this. Maybe I should have come here first. Probably. There's blood on the blade. It would have been too late anyway. Understand? Why would someone want to kill him? Why would someone want to kill Faith? Why would someone want to kill anyone? Because they're pissed off at him. That's why. Um, blood. This is some nice blood. 
Mm. A little sticky. Yeah, there's some blood on the wall too, right there. It's pretty gross. Blood everywhere. Everywhere. What is this? Panel. Oh, that's his bed. That's a cool bed, man. Pretty sweet. Oh, there's a note here from Faith. Oh, no, to Faith. My dearest Faith. Stuck to the bed a little. Yeah, from blood. My dearest Faith, I never meant to hurt you, and I cannot endure knowing that I have. This was for the best. I'll see you again. I'm pretty sure he killed himself. Pretty sure he did. This is a suicide. Wrap it up. Case closed. Hopefully they're together now. Eh, probably not. We can hope for at this point. Yep. Yeah, well, guess what? It was a suicide. Look, there's a picture of Lawrence and Faith. How adorable. Where am I going? Going crazy. When do you think that was taken? A long time ago. Before all this. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> Duh. Man. Oh, now I'm stuck behind here. Great. Uh, what else we got around here? Da, 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 da. Blood on the walls. Nothing of interest. Let's examine Lawrence one more time. Do you have a ring in your mouth? No? It's on the chair. Oh god, there's a gun here. He's packing heat. Man, there's a casing on the ground, so we shot this thing. They'll be on the grip and the trigger. Yeah, well, at least you're not using gloves. I mean, that's always good. Pills! You just hopped up on some... What are they? I don't know, morphine? Sleeping pills. Sleeping pills. Um... Fan. That's nice. That doesn't really help. You know what? Snow? I'm trying my best here, okay? What is this? This is a shell casing. He shot this gun. Matches the caliber of the gun on the floor. Indeed it does. He did have a wound on his head. What did he do? Shoot himself in the head? That didn't work, so he stabbed himself? Pretty sure that's all there is there. I uh, don't really want to examine Lawrence anymore. I'm kind of tired of looking at him, honestly. What's going on down here? Dusty. No one's read these in a while. How most books are, I'm pretty sure. At least the books around here. Uh, let's open the closet. See if there's any mon- Oh, God! That- Oh. Stay here! <laughs> no! <sighs> That literally caused me to jump. And I knew something was going to be in a freaking closet. Jesus, that scared me. I jumped. <laughs> Screw you, man. Hey, stop. Is this Tweedledee or Tweedledum? Leave me alone. What are you doing in here? Oh, you can't freaking stop me. I'm the big bad wolf. How are you going to get outrun by this tubby? Go. He's just chucking stuff at me like crazy. Get back here. Stop in the name of the law. Stop in the name of the law. Can't fight the law, buddy. Where'd you go? Uh, uh, this way. There he is. Ha ha. I stayed on the trail. I keep pressing the wrong trigger, but apparently it keeps working, so I don't know. Oh, I guess I didn't work too well. Go, get him. How is this freaking fat guy parkouring around here? There's no way. Oh, man. Well, that sucks. Go. We've got to go. Where is he at? He's above me. That fat bastard. Get back here. Nope. Uh, jump out the window. I guess either trigger works on those little quick time things. I don't know. Stop it. Where are you going? Man, he's an ugly son of a bitch. I got you. We're on the same side here. You son of a bitch. Run after you. I oughta. Why <laughs> did you run? <clears throat> what? Why did you run? Fuck, man. Because you chased after me. The fuck was I supposed to do? <laughs> no, I you started running. I know how it looks, but I had nothing to do with that. Then who did? Who did? Look, I was just asking him about the girl. That's all. When I mentioned her being dead, he freaked out. I figured someone had told him. How was I supposed to know? Shit. Why are you hiding in the closet? Right in front of me. I couldn't stop him, man. 
So he did shoot himself. What was the knife for then, huh? You're looking for the woodsman, right? I know where he is. My guy says he's holed up at the trip trap. We can go over there right now, the both of us. My employer's looking to ask him a few questions too. Um, who is your boss? Who's your employer? I can't tell you that. It's confidential. Sorry. Sure you understand. I don't actually. Can't say that I do. 